In this video, I'm gonna be talking about the three steps you can take to start becoming great at sports, athletics, or an activity you care about passionately. The person I'm gonna be talking about is someone who I believe embodies the best virtues of the fitness industry. And he calls himself the mad scientist, but I like to think of him as the rational athlete. Mr. Chris Duffin, author of the book, The Eagle and the Dragon. I would highly recommend reading it just for the purposes of mental resilience and to see how he has overcome many different challenges in his life. There are many things he is known for. He has not only created a massive fitness company where he provides some of the best gym equipment out there, but he has also accomplished many powerlifting and strength achievements himself. Two of which, one being a thousand pound squat for multiple reps and a thousand and one pound deadlift for multiple reps. And in just a moment, you're gonna know the three things that keep repeating over and over in every single one of his explanations of how he went about his journey to achieve those results and to get the best out of his body. The first thing that he does is he makes his goal absolutely clear and simple. Not only clear and simple, but he makes sure it is everywhere. He is constantly surrounded by his goal. So he knows what he is working towards. Every decision he makes about his training, his nutrition, recovery, everything you can think of is all in service to that goal. Is it getting him closer? Is it helping him achieve it? Or is it pulling him further away? This is an area that most people don't spend enough time on. They try and think of grand designs and try and do too many goals that are oftentimes conflicting. When it comes to Chris, he just had those goals up on paper saying, deadlift, 1,001 pounds. That's it, clear and simple. He knows what he has to do. It's beelined, it's laser focused. That way he is moving forward and it makes all of his decisions much, much easier to make. Number two, he embarks on strength training and makes it a full part of his routine. It's where he is breaking down those muscles and rebuilding them up as strong as physically possible, from the muscle fibers to the tendons, making sure his body can handle the challenges it's about to take on. In my opinion, the purpose of training, the purpose of exercise is to make your muscles stronger. It's about leaving your ego at the door and just staying absolutely focused, pushing those muscles to trigger that defensive mechanism, which is going to enable the adaption process to become stronger over time. Number three, now that you've focused on strength training to build up those muscle strength, it's taking that strength and now applying it to the skill you want to get really, really good at. So with Chris's example in deadlifts, it was doing the repetitions of deadlifts, making sure his technique, his form, his breathing, everything he did was about making sure he was building up his neuro pathways, making sure it was the easiest thing for him to do. Everything was working as it was meant to. In a different example, imagine you are a tennis player. You can hit the ball, you can hit the ball straight to the line every single time. But as you become stronger, all of a sudden you notice that your accuracy starts going all over the place because you haven't recalibrated that strength and your accuracy. And that's exactly what you need to do. It's about taking that strength and then just doing as much of that specific skill you need to, to learn how to use your newfound strength in it. I know at the beginning of this video, I promised you three steps, but I'm gonna give you a bonus one now. It's taking that time after you've done your workouts to look back on your programs and start looking inside introspection to start questioning, is this everything I can be doing? What's going to improve me? Do I need to find better training partners, better coaches, better equipment, different exercises? What's going to bring this all together? It's having that mindset of growth and expansion and looking for the solution to help enhance you in any other way. Hope you found that useful. Please drop your comments down below and let me know what you think. Like and subscribe and I will see you next week.
Thank you.